We're extremely proud of the new and the world's first ever privately run emergency operations center. We have high hopes for it. It's able to track storms, track pandemics, track um, earthquakes. I'm thinking of all the many dangers that the Philippines faces, volcanic eruptions. And in addition, we're able to plot out private company information, which are password protected, so that our, com our organizations, which often compete with each other commercially, will feel safe including their information on this map that we're building. So we can plot out the hazards that affect their headquarters and their facilities all across the country. It is also a platform where they can report their uh, in the incidents. We have an incident monitoring and they can also see the incidents that has been reported within their network and uh, it will also provide them insights on what is needed and where where, it, uh, where resources are needed. We feel this, this may lead to a sustainability model that other networks can use. In addition, we're hoping that the Emergency Operations Center can serve as a back end to service other organizations in this area so that they can send advisories to the different companies in their country. And we're looking closely at this sort of type of outsourcing model.